Strawberry and chocolate. Ah, oh, Romeo, my love. On this full moon, what couldst thou be up to? What perfect lighting I have. It is time for a selfie to send to Romeo. And a one, two... Juliet! <laughs> <laughs> Juliet, calm down. Tis me. Romeo? How comes here, though? Thy strawberry scent draws me, even in the chocolatey darkness of night, my love. Romeo. Juliet. <laughs> Romeo? <laughs> Give me my long spoon, ho! A chocolate cake! How darest thou come here? <laughs> Juliet! Father, let Romeo go! Silence, daughter! <laughs> Please, sire, Juliet is my world! In no world will Juliet and thou be together! Take this villain out with haste! Yes, yes cuz! <laughs> uh, Juliet! Romeo! Uh, Juliet! Romeo! If thou meet'st that cad once more, you will be banished! <laughs> Romeo! <laughs> Dearest, not approach Juliet again! I'll rip out thy chips, thou chocolate coward! <laughs> <laughs> Juliet, if thee and me couldst be together, into the hottest oven or frozen freezer I'd go. Hast thou lost thy mind? The daughter of my ancient enemy. You'll be banished from my house if you ever see her again. That's not fair. Juliet and I are in the truest of true love. Foolish boy, thou hast gone mad. Mom! Husband, stay thy foul mood. Romeo, apologize to thy father now. Ah, uh, it's no matter. The Valentine's Day party is nigh. A fair chocolate maid will find. One right for thee and this family. Father, I protest! Romeo, uh. please understand. Unless a strawberry cake you're baked anew, there's no world for you and Juliet. Uh, then I'll become a strawberry cake! But thou shalt not see Juliet again! I wonder if this I'll get is <laughs> Indeed, this is Bread Barber Shop. I'm certain Master Bread can turn chocolate to strawberry. Then Juliet's parents shall bless our fair union. 98, 99, 100. That's the number we'll be taking for Valentine's Day this year. I don't want to be, though. Come earlier next year. But I've brought all the money in my purse. Ugh, money is but worthless without my love. <gasps> <laughs> Juliet! <laughs> In the spirit of St. Valentine, I'll accept just one more customer. You want me to turn you into a strawberry cake? Yes, Master Bread. Tis the only way, by my truth. Well, kid, not everyone gets to be baked as a delicious chocolate cake. Why are you trying to change? I must be a strawberry cake for Juliet and I to freely love. Without Juliet, even the richest of chocolate cake is poor. Don't cry now. But who's Juliet, though? Oh, Juliet, my sweet <laughs> strawberry love. But friends, our families are mortal foes. Yeah! Two cake mixes, both alike in dignity. An ancient grudge twixt chocolate and strawberry. These chocolate cowards, this count is ours. Why do the strawberries grow fussy when tis spring no longer? No, but not for the frozen berry. For hundreds of years, our families have fought. <laughs> Huh? Tis bad luck to run into a chocolate cake before the morn is done. I wondered from whence that stench came from. Twas strawberry. Huh? Thou art the color of poop. Comest at me, very brave. Our parents are still old enemies. Huh? I never saw true beauty till now. I think my strawberries might burst. <laughs> At first sight, Juliet and I fell fast in love. We won't let the feud betwixt our families star-cross our love. Tis tragic, Romeo. Real sad, oh. yeah. Please, make me strawberry now. Then Juliet's parents shall finally permit our love. Okay, pal, I'll make it into the sweetest strawberry slice in town. 
Wilk, <laughs> bring all my strawberry stuff here, stat! Sir! <laughs> <laughs> hmm. When I'm through, you yourself won't know who you are. Are you sure you're ready? Yes, for anything! First, let's take this chocolate topper off. Juliet is my uh, whole life! And this topper gets in the way! Hey, love's barrier, fall away! Uh, that is beyond tacky. Uh, uh, I got goosebumps. Now, time for some strawberry cream. Oh, oh, this pink cream is as pure as our love. Oh, strawberries, just like fair Juliet's hair. Oh, Juliet, thine eyes at night shine brighter than the fullest moon. <sighs> Will, shut this guy's mouth. I can't work here. Master bread, deep breaths. Smell of the money Romeo's paying you. Oh, what perfection. Congrats, kid. You're a strawberry oh. cake. Venus, goddess of beauty and true love, sent the great barber bread to renew mine hope once more. Oh, my dear Juliet, we'll finally be together soon. Well, I'm beat. Let's close up. Yeah. What, oh, is is that just that the what if it's discovered mm, that I'm delicious. a chocolate cake? Oh, mm. my! Thy berries are precious, too! See, is that with strawberry cream? They recognize me not. Now I must find fair Juliet! Oh! oh fine. Beg, beg your pardon! Huh? Who art thou? Uh, father! Huh? What hast thou done? Father, stay thou. I'll tell you. Silence! Thou art the heir of the chocolate clan. Now thou art a foul strawberry cake. Uh, Romeo, mm -hmm. thou looks better with all thy chocolate covered. Congrats, thou art now a strawberry cake. It suits thee well. <laughs> Should have changed before. <laughs> to marry fair Juliet, now I'm a strawberry cake. Please, sir, let us be betrothed. Thou shalt not. <laughs> now that thine only heir is turned strawberry, <laughs> Tis kettles for your family! <laughs> <laughs> Lookest thou not smug, knave? <laughs> Seest who's here. What? Uh, is thou Ju Juliet? <gasps> Why art thou a chocolate cake, daughter? <gasps> Did he trick you? No, no. I changed to be with my love, Romeo. <laughs> Husband! What hast thou done? You're a disgrace! <gasps> Father, ow! Oh. Putting strawberry cream on thyself shames us all! Now come! Husband, calm thyself! No matter what thou does, I'll ne'er let you to be with her! Give up! Enough! Please stop, all of you! Heavens above, why must you make us suffer so? Let us love each other! Juliet, let us away! Yes, Romeo! <laughs> Stop right there, boy! Juliet, together we may leap over any wall betwixt our love! Dearest Romeo, <laughs> with thee anywhere I will go! <laughs> Save Juliet from that villain! Uh, bring Romeo back now! Yes! <laughs> uh, insane youths, come quietly! Juliet, even death can take me from you! Romeo, without thee, nowhere I'll go. And now, for the moment you've all been waiting for, time to pick this year's Valentine couple. And this year's Valentine couple is... Congratulations, Romeo and Juliet! They're a chocolate and strawberry cake couple. How delicious. What foolishness is this? Get me down from there! And now, the couple will kiss. <laughs> Strawberry and chocolate have finally become one. Love does conquer all. Stop this instant and this. Congratulations. This year's Valentine couple will be given a special gift from the queen. Who cares for gifts? A brand new sports car! <laughs> Hot nice hands right now! A penthouse in Eclair Estates! <laughs> it doesn't end there, folks. 
If these two get married, the queen will give a one million dollar prize! I always thought Romeo to be a sweet boy. Romeo's a catch, I do agree. Juliet's truly fair, don't you think it's so? I think so. No one can control who their child loves. Tis true! Get married! Get married! Get married! Get married! Get married! Our parents cheer too. I oh. know. Well then, it seems they have finally accepted us. I love you, Juliet. Me too, Romeo. Mm. Wow! Romeo and Juliet get to be happy. It's true love. Love, yeah. Mr. Bread, you know Romeo and Juliet both wanted to be like the other cake. <laughs> So why did you change the book? Uh, mm -mm. A true barber always meets the customer's needs. Wow, I knew there was a reason. I thought you were trying to get double the dough for the same hairdo. Huh? <laughs> what are you trying to Nothing. say? <laughs> Red's date. Well, we're all done. Can you see the customer out? Uh, sure thing. Thank you for coming by. <gasps> hey, is it too late to get a haircut? I'm sorry, we're actually closed right we're now. Never too late. Our shop is open to all any time of day. <sighs> Looks like it's gonna be a long night. Well? Oh, oh, Choco. You look exhausted. Like you expired three years ago or something. Uh, you're right. We had to stay here all night yesterday. The entire night? It's been happening all week. Every single night we stay late. I want to go home. I just don't know why. We're supposed to close. Aha. What about huh? if we get Master Bread a girlfriend? He'll want to leave work early if he's taking out a lady bread. A girlfriend. Mm -hmm. Mr. Bread. What is it now? Hey, you want to go on a blind date? Blind date? No, I don't have time for that stuff. I know the perfect girl for you, sir. She's pretty and kind and smart and funny, too. <laughs> Customers are lining up outside the shop for me these days. Wasting my time on one person doesn't seem very profitable. But this friend has more friends. She could bring more customers to our store. Mm. Not many people match your handsomeness and intelligence, Master Bread. I bet the two of you would be like a matcha made in heaven. I guess I could check my calendar. Are you Master Bread? <gasps> nice to meet you. My name is Tiramisu. This place is great. Oh, sweet cannolis dipped in chocolate. What do I do? I wonder how Master Bread's date went. Just once I'd like to leave work on time. Good morning. <gasps> so, how'd the date go last night? Late? Splendid. In fact, we have plans to meet up again. We're going to watch Green Man one of these days. Isn't it great? Yeah. <laughs> I'm leaving early today. You guys should, too. It worked! Awesome! Well, see you all tomorrow. Good night! See, see you, you tomorrow. tomorrow! Oh, yeah! <laughs> Somebody seems excited to go home. I sure am, thanks to you. I'm gonna go home and binge-watch Donut Ranger Ninja Force! <laughs> ah, Master Bread! Tiramisu said she's sick and can't meet up with me today. Uh, I don't know why I even try to date anymore. There's always work. Will Gil be here, right? Uh, uh, of course. Uh... See ya! I'm off to have dinner with Tiramisu. Night! Bye! Have a good time, sir! Huh? <laughs> String Cheese and I are gonna play video games. Huh? Back already? She told me she had to leave for a last minute business trip. Oh, dating is tough. Might as well just work all night again. <sighs> uh, I used to have a 
social life. I'm finally meeting up with Tiramisu. Clean up and head home. Okay. They got canceled. Let's get ready for more customers. Okay. Seats back oh. on. It's canceled. We're going out. She's busy. Hmm. Ah! Oh. What's going on with you? He keeps changing his plans. I'm at the end of my rope. It's even worse when I get excited and make plans, but then I still have to work late. Do... do you have any other good ideas? Hmm. Looks like he needs to make some moves. Ooh, like what? Hey, listen here. Mm -hmm. We need to get him to talk oh. to her so that then he can... Hmm. Sir? Huh? Question. What do you think of Miss Tiramisu? It's a cake. Lady huh? fingers dipped in coffee. No, that's not what I meant. Plus, I heard Miss Tiramisu really likes you. Really? Mm. What if you confess your feelings to her? Confess? Be honest with her and make your intentions known. Love don't come easy, you know. Okay, sounds good. Uh, but how do I do that? Any ideas? <laughs> Start off with a nice bouquet of flowers, and bring jewelry, too. Jewelry can't go wrong. It'll be great. Who are you? Uh, I thought Tiramisu would be here. This is Tiramisu's house, right? You're looking for her? Hey, Mom! Someone at the door is looking for you! Uh, Mom! Uh, uh, it's some crusty old toast! And now it's making weird noises! Oh, I'm just a side dish! <laughs> <laughs> Little twerp, ah. it's not funny when you call your auntie that. But didn't you say someone was waiting here? I don't see anyone. The weird old man said something about being a side dish and ran off. Oh, kid, you always have the oddest pranks. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Bread, cheer up. It's not you. Well, I've made up my mind. Two left now. Easy now. Steady there. Ah, is he there? Lower there. All I wanted was to go home early. Saburo Pong's crush. <laughs> no, I'm going to be late. I have to be on time for this meeting. Oh, oh, man, what just happened? Get him! Somebody huh? stop that guy! Oh. Ah. Scram! Yeah. Give it back to her! I don't want to have to fight you! Don't let go of my leg! Ah. Stop it! Ah. Ah. That's him! Ah, fine, you ugly weirdo! Jeez Louise. Are you all right? Yes, I'm... Oh. Just play it cool. Here's your wallet. Thanks a bunch. <laughs> okay, gotta go. See you. Hang on. Huh? I'd like to take you out for a meal sometime. How's that sound? Uh, that sounds awesome. Anytime is good. <laughs> <sighs> she was so nice. <gasps> I should get prepared. Hmm? <clears throat> Hey guys, tomorrow I'm gonna go eat with a really pretty girl. Any advice? Nice! About time you started dating. Congrats! What kind of outing will it be? Um, don't you have a streusel crust? Hmm. Yes, my outer layer actually does give me some self-confidence issues. It's tough. Yeah, girls don't really like crusty skin. What should I do about it? 
Get rid of it if you can. I'm sure under all those sugary mm -hmm. bits, there's a good-looking guy. Why not try the Bread Barber Shop? <gasps> a lot of people's problems have been fixed by the Bread Barber. Bread Barber? Ooh. Hmm. Hmm. Looks like a lot of work. <laughs> that nose can be fixed, <laughs> along with overall hair quality, <gasps> too. But the biggest issue is that sugar crust! I want to look like this. Is that possible? Hmm. You're asking me to do something seemingly impossible. Which is why... Huh? You've come to the right place. I can do anything. Thank you, sir. No! Hmm. You all right with a little pain? Sure, of course. I'm willing to do whatever it takes. Give me all you got. Let's start. Tweezers. Ah! 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 Stay still. This part requires precision. Wow, it'll take forever. This is good. That's true. I'll have to use this. A mask that peels off? Ah! Just stay still. Hang on. Hmm. As long as I look good tomorrow, it's worth all the yeah. pain. Yeah. Oh. <gasps> Is that me? I'm a whole new bread. <laughs> and that's not all. We're not finished. This season's hottest color, pale pink, will look great on you. Ah! <laughs> Some rainbow sprinkles and a powdered sugar dust to top it all off. Huh? Ah! There, you really are a whole new bun. She'll fall in love with you now. Wow, it's unbelievable. Thank you, sir. I have a new sense of confidence now. <laughs> Wait, huh? one more thing. Since you are still a Soboro bread, your sugar crust will come back. And your date in three hours' time. Yep, got it, sir. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, gotta hurry! Don't want to be late! <laughs> Don't cry, little buddy. What's wrong? My balloon! Yeah, almost! Almost there! Yeah. <laughs> here you go! Careful! Not late. Ooh. Uh, uh, ooh. Uh, if these don't sell, I won't be able to buy gifts for my grandkids. Oh. Yeah. Uh, Let me help you, please. I'll push from behind. It's quite heavy. Are you certain? Yes, of course. We can get it past this hill together. Uh, holy crust, I'm a whole hour late now. <laughs> oh, man, my old face. How can I meet Cookie with all this crust? Is that you? <laughs> what took you so long? I was about to leave since you stood me up. I know. I just wanted to look handsome. I tried to be here on time. You know, a proper man shows up on time and doesn't look disheveled. But the best kind of man is a kind-hearted one. Like you, Mr. Saboro. Huh? Huh? Yep, just like you. You only look disheveled because you helped that little boy get his balloon back. And you were late because you helped that old woman with her heavy cart. You saw that? That's right. You did so many good deeds today, Mr. Saboro. Ah. Know what I think? I think we should meet up more. What do you think, <gasps> Saboro? Want to date me? No? Yes, I do. That sounds awesome. Good. Uh, I'm going to stick right by you. Uh, oh, wow. I never thought my kind deeds would result in a girl as nice as you. You're pretty nice yourself. Yeah. <laughs> Chaco's first love. Large coffee, please. Here you go. Mmm, nice hot Earl Grey. 
Huh? <laughs> I didn't order an Earl Grey coffee. What the? Huh? Ah. Uh. Hi. Uh. You're Choco, am I right? Ah. Uh. Earl Grey muffin. Hi. Still the same. Wow. <laughs> It's been such a long time. What are you up to these days? Well, I work at this barber shop. How about you? I work for a company. By the way, you're more gorgeous than you were before. And your hairstyle's so cool. <laughs> and you still have that amazing Earl Grey scent, of course. <gasps> it's already nine o'clock. Sorry, gotta oh, run. See you wait, later. Wait, hold on. Mm -hmm? Choco, are you free this evening? Uh? I know oh. a fabulous restaurant. The oh. food is incredible. Here. <gasps> Take my business card. Pyramid Inc. sales team chief? Sure. <sighs> Morning, Choco. <clears throat> Choco, you okay? <gasps> Master Bread, Choco's acting huh? weird, like she's under some kind of spell. What? Choco's acting weird? Choco, you feel okay? <clears throat> oh yeah, definitely weird. <clears throat> It's a business card. Earl Grey Muffin. Uh, oh. Don't touch my stuff, okay? Choco, what's wrong? I know, he's your bun friend, right? Uh, no, he's not. Bet you're <laughs> right, sir. <laughs> Who knew Choco had a love oh, interest? <laughs> <sighs> Long story. We first met years ago when we were in high school. L leave me alone, uh -huh. okay? You better empty those pockets or else. A punch for every dime you got. <laughs> but, but I don't have any money. I spent all I had on my guitar. What? Guitar? <laughs> <laughs> Muffins can't play guitar. Two tough pastries, huh? Mm -hmm. Check out the baby freshman. <laughs> Keep on walking, little baby. <laughs> Get up now. Oh, thanks for the help. Uh, you're in trouble now, kid. You have no idea who we are, do you? Yeah, you're right. I don't know who you are. But I do know two big, tough, baked goods picking on a muffin half their size <gasps> is wrong. So it's wrong, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Looks like baby knows how to fight. Excuse me, mm -hmm. I don't know how to thank you. I'm Earl Grey Muffin. May I get your name? Choco. Oh, Choco. No way. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Choco, I got this for you. <laughs> but what's it for? Just a small token of my thanks. Well, I'll see you later, okay? <laughs> uh, mm, of love and loaves. Really? A book of poems? Oh, what's this here? Thank you for yesterday. Will you be my special friend? Yours, Earl Grey Muffin. Friend, huh? How sweet. Hmm. Sometimes love is lonely. What, really? Who sings on a roof anyway? Maybe you're lonely too. Mm -hmm. uh, Choco, we meet again, I see. Uh, hey. <laughs> Have you ever played a guitar? Give it a try. I don't play. Uh, then I'll uh, teach you, okay? Uh, there, C chord. Oh. Wow, he plays guitar and everything? He sounds great. Mm -hmm. Nothing like the old six strings to impress a lady. That's not the end of the story. Choco. Oh, hi, Earl. <laughs> that fast food is not healthy. From now on, eat this. What's in here? All homemade by me. You made it? <laughs> it's real good. Uh, right? Try this now. <laughs> um, Choco? Yeah? I just mm -hmm. wrote a new poem. Wanna hear oh. it? You wrote a whole poem, Earl? Title, The Most Beautiful Star. In the immense night sky there was a star, so bright, so beautiful, oh, how it shone. Were that bright star <gasps> mine? Know what? I wrote that for you. Me? I'm really flattered. Choco. Earl Grey. Just look at this PDA. Uh, what are those two lovebirds uh, doing? She may have humiliated us once, but I'll get my revenge. If you want to save your muffin boy, come to the roof after school. Uh, uh, how dare they? I'll show them. <laughs>
Choco! They ambushed me! I Keep quiet, kid. Well, look at here. The little freshman baby. Let him go now! Oh no, I'm scared. Think you're pretty tough, huh? Everyone, attack! <laughs> You guys are pathetic. Huh? Hey, are you okay, Earl? Uh, uh, you're so scary. Scary? How did one pretty little girl fight off 17 guys? You're the scariest of them all. Uh, what? I just wanted to help. Excuse me. Mm -hmm. Choco, we've all fallen in love with your fighting skills. Yeah, Miss Choco. Could you teach us how to do that? We'll be devoted to you forever. Please say you'll be our leader. Uh, Please, Jocko. Um, this is weird. Not long after, I moved to a brand new school, and I never saw Earl again. Wow! One girl mm -hmm. against 17? Mm -hmm. Jocko, that's amazing! Well, I must say, your friend Earl acted cowardly. So do you think you'll see this Earl Grey Muffin guy anyway? Mm -hmm. Yeah, we're having dinner. Dinner? You don't have much time left, do ya? Master Brett, maybe you could do Choco's hair for her. She has mm -hmm. to look her best for her mm -hmm. old friend Earl. Right. She's seeing her first love, so she has to look special. Uh, I can just go like this, so... Choco, don't worry about money. I'll give you a 50% off employee discount. Now, uh, let the uh... Choco makeover begin! Yeah! <laughs> hmm. All right. Firstly, let's get rid of this helmet. <laughs> <laughs> Are you crazy? You want to make an impression with this guy, don't you? <laughs> Voila! Is this Choco or is it Cleopatra? Uh, too old fashioned. What? All right then. <laughs> Ta da! A youthful ponytail style, huh? I'd say it's too youthful. What, really? Uh... How about oh. these cute little buns, eh? What are you doing? I'm not 13, you know. Uh, but buns are my specialty! All right, then. Time to try the uber-glamorous Audrey Hepburn special. <laughs> well, you like it? Huh? Uh -huh. I... so cool. Uh -huh. Wow, Choco, you're so pretty. Uh -huh. Was I right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm loving this look. Choco, good luck. May your first love be new. Yeah. <laughs> Choco. Oh, hi. Uh, sorry for being late. I had to finish some work. Oh. Choco, oh. you've changed your hairstyle. It looks amazing. Mm. Uh, really? Mm-hmm. You've always been beautiful, but now you're even prettier. Thank you, Earl. Actually, Choco, oh. I'd like to give you a little gift. Huh? I've wanted to give you this for a long time, and, well, tonight's the night. Huh? For you. What is it, Earl? Pyramid Cosmetics? Mm. Uh. This here is our exciting new cosmetic line. Everything is totally organic. When you put it on, your skin will glow like the sun. And you'll get our discount, so it's practically free. Wait, oh. is this why you invited me here? <laughs> oh, no. It's only our products are so wonderful. Uh, I'm out of here. I can't believe I agreed to see uh, this coward again. Oh. Oh. Hey, you oh. there. I broke out all over because yeah. of your cosmetics. Yeah. I used your cheap face glaze, and it was a total disaster. This muffin's a liar. <laughs> all organic you right in the kisser. I didn't know. Yeah! Oh, please, no! Hey, let go! I totally get that you're upset, but violence is never the answer. Hey, let him go! Really, I'm so over this. Choco? Mm -hmm. Looks like you rescued me again. Thank you. You know, you really haven't changed much at all, have you? What do you mean? My handsome face? My glowing skin? Uh, no. You're a loser. Now please don't call me again. Ch Choco! Uh, what? 
Choco, what happened to your new hairstyle? I gave you an employee discount and everything! Thanks anyway, Master Bread. But I think having my own style is just a little more cool. Way to go! It's always better to be yourself! <laughs> See if I can! <laughs> Chocolate wall. Okay, ready? Mm -hmm. Fast ball. <laughs> Great. Why'd you hit it over the wall, huh? Now we'll never get our ball back, and it's all your fault! Uh, My bad. So, guys, what? what is this wall anyway? I know what's on uh, the other side. My dad told me. A bunch of huge, scary giants! He said the town built this wall to keep them from devouring us. Uh, really? No way! Uh, I saw a video online that said there's a place called the Ice Kingdom over there, and if you climb over the wall, you freeze in seconds flat! <laughs> I'm freezing already. Ah, big deal. Let's go oh. play soccer, dudes. All right. <laughs> I'm home. Hey, son. Just in time for dinner. Mom, you know that giant wall? Why did the town build it anyway? The wall? Why do you want to know? My friends say scary giants are on the other side. Or kingdom made of ice. Stop with your nonsense. Now sit down, your dinner's getting cold. Then go and do your homework. Mm, okay. Oh. I wonder what really is over there. Sweetheart. Uh, uh, hi, Grandma. I know you're working hard, so I brought a snack for oh. you. <laughs> Thank you, Grandma. <laughs> Grandma? Do you know what's behind that great big wall? I sure do. In fact, many years ago, I lived on the other side. Really? Hmm, yes. Back then, dark chocolates and white chocolates all lived happily together. Mm -hmm. Do you both promise to love, honor, and cherish one another today and forevermore? Yes. yes. Then I now pronounce you married. <gasps> What's happening? <laughs> Sweetheart! Say on. <laughs> was the last time I ever saw him. What? No! <sighs> well, all that's behind us now. Although I must say, I do wish I could see him just once more before I die. <sighs> oh, Grandma, huh? we've got to get rid of the wall. Then you'd be able to see Grandpa, right? Yes, I suppose so. <clears throat> then I'll get rid of that wall for you! You are? Mm-hmm. I have to. People are unhappy. Shouldn't they be able to see the ones they love? Do you really think you can? How wonderful. You're such a good boy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna take you down for good! <laughs> Yo, what are you doing? Uh, uh, nothing. Are you trying to break through that wall? Yeah. But uh, why? You don't want to be a giant's lunch, do you? You're wrong! There are no giants over there! My grandma told me the story. There are chocolates like us living on the other side. What? Even my grandpa lives over there. This wall keeps him from seeing grandma. Whoa. Really? Then we're gonna help you knock this thing down, buddy! Mm -hmm. Really? Mm -hmm. These pickaxes aren't working at all. Why did they have to make it so impenetrable? Now what? Ugh, I'm gonna take a nap. Yeah, I'm thoroughly exhausted. Mm -hmm. Whoa! Hang on, guys! Mm -hmm. Look at this! 
Fred the Genius Barber? I think I saw him on TV. Yeah, maybe we could ask him for help. <laughs> Morning! Um, this letter came hmm? for you. What? For me? Oh, it's from Chocolate Town, eh? Would you help us knock down this wall? I'm far too busy for such nonsense. What do I care about some silly wall? It's from Chocolate Town? Whoa, can we go? I hear good chocolate's mm. super pricey these days, boss. Maybe you can get some freebies out of it. What? We might get free <laughs> chocolates if we go? Wilk, get us packed! Sir! <laughs> Are you still trying to break through? It's never gonna work. It's got to. I promised my grandma she could see Grandpa one more time. Huh? Whoa! Guys, look at that plane. That's Master Fred up there. What? You seriously think that guy would come here? Yeah. And besides that, we don't have an airport. Huh? I'm falling! Somebody! <laughs> it's him! <laughs> These chocolates better be top notch. Completely blinded. Oh yes. So this is the wall you meant. Yeah. We tried to use pickaxes, but we couldn't break through. It's kind of sturdy, sir. About five centimeters sturdy, I'd say. I'm afraid knocking it down ourselves would be impossible. You see, we told you it was a bad idea. Even Master Brett says it's too hard. Wait, there might be a way. Huh? If we can't break through, we'll make it disappear. Disappear, sir? I just might have a plan. Now gather all the town folk right away. Hmm. What's this meeting about? What's this about? about? They just said to meet here. Attention! Huh? I came to Chocolate Town to help my friend here. My name is mm -hmm. Brett, and I'm a famous barber. That's the dude from all those posters in town. Yeah, but what is he doing here? Hey, that's my little boy huh? over there. I know this wall separates many of you from your friends and family. Now, do you want to knock down this wall and see the folks you love? Of course we do. Well, sure. But how can we knock down a wall that big? My friend, I will show you how. We'll use these. Here you go. This? I don't know. How can a paintbrush help? I'll tell you. Paint your wishes on the wall right here like graffiti and watch it crumble down. Will it really? I don't see how. Trust me, my friends. Now write your hearts out. <laughs> we'll do it together, Grandma. If you say so. Mom, come on. Oh? Just think, Dad. Wouldn't it be great to see Grandpa again? Well, I guess it couldn't hurt. I mean, what have we got to lose? Come on, <laughs> write it all out, folks. Tell me, my dear, do you really think this will work? Yeah. Mm hmm. <laughs> <laughs> hmm, this might do the trick. Hey, Mr. Mm -hmm. Red, is the wall gonna fall down soon? We wrote on the wall uh -huh. like you told us. Don't worry, it'll happen any moment now. Nine. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, showtime! Ugh, my shoulder. Well, this meeting's got it harder than a rolling pin. Uh, how this divider gets so dirty? I guess I'll have to replace it. Uh -huh. What's going what? on? <laughs> an earthquake! Whoa. It's lifting into the air! Look! Uh -huh. It's going Master up! Master Bread was right! Oh, oh, oh. There are white chocolates in there. I never ever thought I'd see the day. Percy, my boy! My Dad. darling! Uh, uh, Rosé, my dear! Diva! <laughs> Leon, I can't believe it! It's been so long! I've missed you! <laughs> Where could he be? My love! <gasps> can it be? Darling, I've missed you so much. I've missed you, my dear. <laughs> wow, sir. Those chocolates have never been happier. I'm so glad we could help them be together. Me too. This will look much neater. 
dark chocolates and white chocolates all mixed together in one box. Looks much prettier that way. Perhaps I'll just leave it like that then. <laughs>